You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and it's time for a Yummy Nummies Mini Kitchen Magic. Chewy and delicious, super tiny gummy goodies maker. Wow. No bake. Ages six plus. All the food ingredients made in the USA. Let me show you this side. Let me see. Mix, make, enjoy. We like that. Then this side's a repeat. Tells you kind of the same thing. And then here is the list of ingredients. It looks like it's bursting with cherry, tropical punch, and blue raspberry. So three packets of flavors. A spoon, a scoop, a plate, instruction sheet, and then one kitchen magic tray. Gummy Goodies Maker. Now, I've seen gummy a lot of times spelled G-U-M-M-I. So they spell it G-U-M-M-Y. All right, let me just see what's in the box. I have a new mat that I got just for these videos. And let's see, it looks like I'm going to have to get the tape off here. Oh, that was easy enough. Oh, look at that, a nice tray. All right. So that's the size. So it looks like we have an elephant, a puppy, a giraffe, and an owl. I know, hard to see. Maybe you can see them from that side if I shade it just a little. All right. And the instructions, my little plate, and my utensils. And I've been keep. I kept the ones from the last set. And then here's my packs. All right. So this is everything we have and my instructions. So I will gather some supplies, my water, and the mat, and we'll get started. All right, here we go. I have everything organized. I like to kind of just set it all up so I know what I'm working with. So now the packets are number 15, 16, and 17, one of each flavor. And then the tray, you get your little plate, which I like, and then your scoop and your spoon for mixing. So pretty much uh, directions are real simple. Open the cherry, tropical punch, and blue raspberry packets in each of trays one, two, three, and four. Add two scoops of a single flavor or two scoops of combined flavors to create your own flavor. I like that. So let's do that. Let me get out my scissors. So since they give you four trays and three packets, I can combine. Let's see. I have blue raspberry, cherry, and tropical punch. I'll probably combine the cherry blue raspberry and not the tropical punch i'll cut open the top of each one so there's the blue raspberry here i'll lean them up here and then let's see what this one looks like it smells good the first one smells really good there's the next one mm, cherry and now the tropical punch Ooh, not what I was expecting. Mmm, it smells actually like banana. Okay, so two scoops in each tray. So let's start. And it looks like they give you plenty. One, two. Okay, we'll move that one out of the way. And then one. And then the last one is blue raspberry. Okay, so I'm gonna put two here, one, two, and then I'm gonna add two there, or one there. And I'll mix that with a scoop of something else. I'm just kinda like tap, tapping it. Oop, look at that. I hit the edge of the bag. All right, so there are one there. And then one of the red. There, I think that's hopefully gonna make purple. And then, let's see, let me clean this up a little bit where I spilled. Hold on, I'll just... <laughs> there, done. And now let's see. It is add three three scoops of water into tray one and mix well. Let me move these all the way. But it looks like you can keep making them. You don't have to stop. And I bet if you have other little molds, you can use those as well. So three scoops in each one. So let me do the first one first. One, two, three. And we'll mix that. Go around this way. Can you
and you can tell it's changing consistency now. I move it up a little bit closer so you can kind of see the lumps. I know it's a little brighter when I move it up here. Okay, I think that's good. You still see a couple of the lumps in there, so well, let me see. Let me try to squish it on the sides. Just here. I want to make a quick adjustment to my camera. Hold on a second. All right, I felt it was just a little too bright, so here we go. I will turn this into a yellow giraffe. Let's taste it. Yeah, it tastes like banana to me, pineapple or some flavor like that. Okay, so it's over the edges just a little. And look at you still got some more in there. And then three scoops into the next one. Let's try it. Oh, there's a little hint of blue in there. See that in the corner that I spilled when I hit my packet? This is more pinkish to me. Wow, I feel real sloppy today. I don't know why. It's just the way it's working out. It is harder to hold it up in the air and do this. Let me change my camera position here and then I can just do it this way. Okay. There we go. That's easier. Now I can just leave it sit here. Alright, so let's do a pink elephant, huh? Well, after this, it's supposed to sit in the refrigerator. And if I remember correctly, it said, fill them up to the brim. They want it to be filled really good. Okay. Next one. One, two, and three. Look at that, see? You know what it is? I'll tell you exactly what it is. You know the indentations on the bottom where they hit the number? See, my spoon hit that, and that's why it flipped out. All right, that one makes the best. Puppy, I'm doing a blue puppy. Okay, puppies filled to the brim. And the last one is the owl. This is the combo color. What I like about these kits is that you get extra, plenty of extra to keep making them. You don't have to stop with what you've just made. Oops, see it hit the number on the bottom again. And yes, it's turning a slight purple here. Okay, it looks like you could probably make another whole two rounds of gummy still after this. Here we go. Oh, it's got to cross over my owl. I mean, my puppy. Oh, it's kind of neat. You still see some of the pink and blue chunks in there. Yeah, 
And then it says, place the entire tray in the refrigerator for 15 minutes. Which means my trays here are going to turn into gummies. All right. So let's go put this in the refrigerator for 15 minutes. It's starting to set up already. Look at that, setting up. And I will be back with my gummies. And we'll check them out and we'll taste them. We'll put them on our little plate and see what they're like. I'll be right back. All right, my batch of gummies is ready. So let me uh, start by taking out one of the ones inside this section here, because that's a very edible looking gummy. So I'll save it here in the little bowl off to the side. And then here, let me take this one out. Look at that. Cool, it's got colors inside of it. And here is the red one. Ooh, look at that. And then the yellow one. Came out really nice. All right, so let's see. That's what they look like in my bowl. Let's just look at each one here and see how they come out. Okay, you just gotta get underneath it. Here's my, oh, I ripped my puppy ear. Let me see if I can salvage my puppy. Come here, buddy, you need that. Oh, that's not how that went. <laughs> that's how that went. I think it went like that. Okay, puppy ear saved. Let's see if I use this side. Go a little slower. Oh, see, I ripped off my elephant leg. Oh, This is going to be hard to get out this one, too. Next time I probably get something a little smaller and work them out a little differently. Okay. Yeah, see those would almost need like a toothpick and get them out real nice and even. All right, and then the last one is the owl. And look, he came out the best. Oh, just a little bit ripped off. All right, well, there you go. Let me show you all of them. Get them positioned better here. I don't know if I want to eat these guys. There we are, so they came out really good. Let's try each flavor. So, Tropical Punch is the yellow one. I'm gonna take a bite of that one. Mmm, it's a very soft gummy. Tasty, pineapple tasty. And then blue raspberry. Mm. And then the cherry, that's packet number 015. That one's good, and this is the combo one. I think they're all really tasty. Now, it's not a gummy like you think of a gummy. It's more like um. here, you can see it. It has like a jello-y kind of consistency, not like a hard to chew gummy. There's my combo. Hmm. I'm gonna say it's really good. And besides a few little infractions on my figures here, I would say it's a pretty neat little kit. So it's the Yummy Nummies Mini Kitchen Magic. And if I wanna show you one more time, it looks like you can make a whole nother couple batches since it's only two scoops of these here I'll show you inside each one it looks like I'm guessing you can make even more than 10 but they say you can make 10 and there's four in the tray so you can make a whole other batch plus some and thanks for watching hope you like this next yummy nummies video we have a lot more on the way every Saturday approximately I believe it's Saturday I slip my mind we'll have a new set so stay tuned and if you enjoy these sets you know let me know in the comments and thanks for watching and supporting lucky penny shop and they are tasty and easy to do later if you're looking for the item you just saw in the video click here watch more videos by clicking here don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up hey lps dave 
What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. You can always remember when you see a lucky penny. Pick it up. Thanks for watching.